This is Gavarok Fevenor, welcoming you to Let's Play Final Fantasy 1, Dawn of Souls. I'm talking a little bit quietly now because I'm not in my usual recording location, and I'm not entirely sure how I'll be able to be overheard. So, you might want to turn your volume up for this one, and for the next... Well, a lot actually, next heaps, because I will be talking quietly as a permanent um, thing for the next week. I'm on holiday. Yep, I'm here sitting here in Queensland, which is a, another state of Australia. Um, I'm sitting here in a hotel room. My own. Two beds, one of which is my bed, the other which, other of which is not going to be used at all. I've got the door shut, and just outside a TV is going on, so let's hope it um, doesn't come through. Alright. Um, I, at the moment I have no internet connection, so you're probably not going to see this, but we are arranging something, and unlike my previous thoughts, it is possible I might get some broadband, so I might be able to upload at no cost to myself. Hooray, hooray, hooray for that. Okay. Um, we're looking for the stairway down to floor 3, or basement 3 of Caverniverse now, because we've gotten all the chests in basement 2 and once we get down to basement 3 we will indeed be quite good but of course there's all of these fights they take so long Number three, final floor, well, not exactly, still got two more floors actually, this one goes down to five, but as I said, we can't go down the mall right now, just three. Die mummy. Seems weird. I mean, I'm killing my mummy. Sh shouldn't I feel a bit, um, sad? A bit apprehensive over the idea of killing my mummy. I don't know. Some strange reason I. Okay. What are they doing here? What are they doing here? Why are the biscuit demons here? <laughs> okay, compose thyself, compose thyself. Still alive, still alive, for now, for now. <laughs> I keep forgetting myself and accidentally going to use items instead of magic. But yes. From now on, the Pisker Demons are officially commonplace. So we're going to have to be on our guard. Because you don't know what's going to happen with them. They might just attack. And more trivial fights hmm. happen. Yep, yep, hooray, hooray, we win today. I see a little reason to cast Ayara. There we go, that should kill him, and if it doesn't, I'm going to punch myself. I'm quite accustomed to punching myself right now. I do it a lot. For fun. Just for fun. 
There they go. Hooray! Okay, another chesty room. That's a lot. Uh, yeah. This is not worth it. Going this way. But still, I will. Because I am ridiculous. And it's that sheer ridiculousity that fuels me. Get out of my way! <laughs> Just die. I'm not you, Fervon! Uh, I'm a bit off today. I mean, I'm still sick a little bit. But I'm mainly off because of like that. Ooh. Sorry. <coughs> I'm okay! As I was saying, I'm a little off mainly because I was on a plane earlier today. And my ears do not go well with plane flight. Uh. Well, I'm okay during takeoff. I'm perfectly fine, no problems, you just go straight up. And then during the normal flight to flight part of it, which is simple, get out my laptop. Can't record, obviously, that'd be a bit funny watching someone. Yeah, can you imagine that on a flight? Just all quiet, and then the person next to you gets out a microphone and starts saying, This is Gavrock Fivador, welcoming you to Let's Play. <laughs> You'd feel like you were in a bloody radio studio. But yes. Middle of the flight was fine, just watched some Lost episodes on my um, laptop, which is sounds sort of funny, me watching Lost, which is a show about a plane crash when I'm on a plane. Uh, that was a really bad idea. I think the guy next to me went a bit nuts, but other than that, it was fine. Um, it's just the landing. It uh, gives me horrible, horrible ear problems. It makes them go. It gives me horrible pain. Uh, no one else that I know seems to be affected by it except my father, and he. I don't think he gets the same thing that I do. It seems a bit different when he talks about it. But it's always been a problem of mine, and I thought I'd share it with you because I have nothing else to say, and um, if I was silent you'd think there was a problem or you'd be celebrating one or the other why do you stand directly in my way oh hell key off go key yourself right two more doors I believe ah oh, for bloody hell's sake not that bloody hell has a sake, I mean, this. it's not like you're going to actually do something for bloody hell. Why would you want to do something for that? Yeah. It's the full of shit in me that is really coming through there. I think those are the uh, required encounter monsters that you get in all the chests. Because whenever you go to certain squares in front of these things, you always get a monster. Those are really easy, though, those earth elementals. You just have to hit them once and they fall. It's a door. A rather ominous looking door, because that pad isn't moving. It's interesting. I think I might save. And save the emulator way to save state, save state. As you can see, it says wrote to save state 1. You used to say it there. Though you probably can't see it because the quality on YouTube is crap and you can't read a word even if you tried. Well, we're going to explore this little room when we come back. For now. In Let's Play Final Fantasy 1 Dawn of Souls. The Queensland Edition. I shall say, fare thee well.